What is going on YouTubers? Abdrawer Sound here from AndroidTechBlogspot.com So today I'm gonna show you how to flash my new ICS Objection ICS ROM UCLF5 base So if you don't know uh, we had a release Thank you to our great Design Gears for releasing it. Uh, we had a release and the new version is UCLF5 and uh, ICS Objection has been updated to that base and now I will show you how to flash that this ROM. First of all what, what you need to do is boot into CWM Clockwork More Recovery. Once you're here go to Wipe Data Factory and just double tap double tap and it will start wiping or formatting your data once it's done you'll be going one tab under it wipe cache then you will go advance wipe delve cache first one Once it's that done, go back, go to mount, restore. Now you will be formatting data. Please don't ask why I do this three times because this way I just want to make sure that you have everything wiped and it's less worries for you and you will have less problems once the ROM is done flashing. So once you are done wiping, what you need to do is go install zip from SD card and depending on where you have your ROM downloaded, this is external, this is internal. So I have it in external, so I will go in external and find my zip file where I have it and this is the one that we're gonna flash. See it says Team Perfections ICS Objection UCLF5 so just double tap that I wanna let you guys know that this ROM will reboot itself and it will clear cache at the end cause most of the people didn't don't follow the instruction every time I told tell them to so I just made it so we'll do it so some features of this ROM if you're wondering as always I got some homemade Indian spices in it because I like spicy food uh, it's deep loaded DDox. I forgot to put SC binary so it's not rooted it has AOSP and TW lock screen so AOSP is gonna be right here and TW can swipe anywhere else on the screen and it will still unlock I had to do that because uh, some people like TW some people like AOSP so now it's win-win situation for both it's Jeeper Langd, DSP Manager, HD YouTube, AT&T Visual Voicemail, SIP or 3G 4G, uh, Sony Bravia, Flipboard S Voice, Added Host Blocking, Lag Free, AOSP Low, Audio improvements, speed tweaks, S Vox, Samsung TTS, uh, shut down animation, boot sound, AirDroid, wallpaper scroll. I removed yellow pages from context, and context has been themed. Tweaks for perfection. That means I put some tweaks that will make your note perfect. Or I will try to make it perfect. JPEG quality has been raised I have quick pick in there tether and more to come and team perfection is all about pursuing the perfection on any form that we work on so right now as you guys can see it's flashing
it will take time because it's setting up system now it's rebooting I don't know why I always put the sound in every single ROM, I just fell in love with it since I heard it. So now it will reboot the phone. And from there, I will take you into next video on reviewing this ROM. It will take time to boot don't panic just leave it alone go get a beer or two just forget about the phone for 10 minutes that's it once the phone starts rebooting put the phone in freezer or something forget about it for 10 minutes that's the best way to flash ROM because it will help the phone to reset correctly and set the new base correctly compared to you trying to modify the way you want as soon as it boots that's that's just not correct way to do it I'm playing with my Apple mouse now once you see it's booting up you will see the application start installing that's CW and GUI Adobe Reader Quick pick and Wi-Fi tether, and that's it, guys. Thank you for watching this videos. Subscribe up there, like it right here. Go in description, check out the blog. Thank you for watching the videos and all the support. I will see you in the next one.